These waiters might find those bodies. Uh oh. Oh no, this is escalating. Oh, this is escalating a lot. Okay, <laughs> they're all dead. I'm making the line, he sees you when you're sleeping a lot scarier, honestly. Huh. <laughs> the amount of people Santa's killing is just so unnecessary. Why are you responding to the calls for help? Like, oh, Santa Claus is killing people. Like, you think it's just a little holiday joke. <laughs> oh no, oh no, Santa's dying, Santa's dying. I should get out of here. This may not have been the best idea. Yeah, let's get back inside. <laughs> Santa doesn't like the cold. No, 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 don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. I'm fucking Christmas. <laughs> and I gotta restart it all. Santa Claus, more like... <laughs> Bor Ragnar, no, more like angry man. Santa's a bit of a creep anyway. Breaking and entering is not cool. So the first one I want to look at is Santa's boot camp, which just sounds absolutely horrifying. They describe it as Willy Wonka meets the breakfast club at Christmas. Wait, what the hell? You saw that too, right? <laughs> that wasn't just me? <gasps> What? He keeps disappearing. I want to murder him. Wait, oh, I thought he couldn't disappear when I was standing on top of him. Maybe he really is real. <laughs> and you know what? If you look at him closely, Jim Pickens looks almost like Santa Claus. And I've never seen them in the same room, so I'm not entirely sure they're different people. And I know what you're thinking. What a great opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> He's already laughing. He knows what's coming. I know what you're thinking. What a great opportunity to dress up as Santa and make the neighborhood a better place. Or should I steal Christmas? Okay, so we gotta kill Harry and Marv, but I think Santa is also on the map. So I'm just adding him to my list, to my naughty list to be exact. I'm just happy I can finally be inserted into the Home Alone universe. I've been sent the clip of the woman screaming Kevin quite a lot. <laughs> So this has been a long time coming. All right, assassinate them in any accident while disguised as Santa 47. <laughs> Collect all 12 items the burglars want to steal before they do. That's going to be hard. Pass my Marv three times using bricks. I just keep chucking bricks like, haha, just like Home Alone. And he's like, please stop. You're causing brain damage. All right, I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready to ruin Christmas. I'm telling you, nothing ruins Christmas like a few bricks to the head. Now, I have a special plan today. You see, it is in fact Winterfest, but I seem to be on the naughty list. But don't worry, I have a special place in the cult for Santa Claus. Wait, no, don't don't go around the back. Why are you going around the back? You need to come inside. Oh, Jesus, the graves. Okay, yeah, uh, Grim, you go collect the graves so people won't be feckin' depressed. Call over, yes. Come into the kitchen. <gasps> Here he is. Okay, great. Oh, God damn it! I lost my flirtiness. Oh, wait, I can woohoo? Try, uh, try it. Go right for it. Don't even say hello. Just go for it. Wait, th that worked? Okay, that was a lot easier than I thought. Everyone, you guys just stay down here, I guess. I've been an awful good gym Santa baby. So hurry down the chimney tonight. I love how Santa has that skull and crossbones over his head because he's joined the cult. Look, at this his romance is almost full already. Oh, Jesus, it's grim. Uh, serenade. Maybe not right now. Grim, maybe you should go downstairs and, like... Play chess. He wants to serenade Santa Claus now. He basically just wants to serenade. He doesn't care about the person. Ask to move in. Wait, no, stop singing. Just ask him to move in. I literally just clicked on it. Oh, that is beautiful, though. You gotta give it to him. This is so great. I'm so happy. Oh my god, how much money does he have? He has half a million simoleons. Come on in, buddy. No wonder he's giving out all those presents for free. He's ballin'. Go inside. You're burning. Please go inside. Look at him. He's smoking and smoldering. Okay, great. Welcome to your new home. Eric, please stop, okay? Otherwise, we're not gonna see Santa. He looks a little bit old to be that excited about seeing Santa. I don't think that would be a threat. <laughs> oh, 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 and off you go, young lady. I'll see what I can do Christmas morning. <laughs> I still don't understand what he's saying. <laughs> This guy's promising these kids a lot. He just said he was gonna get him a monkey. He promised another girl that he was gonna get her a mansion in California. He's setting up a lot of disappointment. But you're gonna sit on his lap and you're gonna love it. <laughs> that was so creepy. Oh, what is this? Corky, do you see what I have to put up with? Oh my God, is she messaging the real Santa? Oh, they're gonna be in trouble now. I would like to understand women. <laughs> this guy's like 20. He's just desperate. He has nowhere else to go. I better get what I want this year, Santa. Oh my god, this guy is threatening Santa. He's not even real. What? 
Are she surprised? It's a fake Santa! What? Like, fair enough for the younger people, but so many of them are so old. I think they're, they're, they're a bit too old to be surprised that it's not the real Santa sitting there in this mall. <laughs> oh my god, they're charging him. They're gonna kill him. Oh my god, the elves are freaking out. To be fair, she did send a video. Oh no, what is this snap? Oh. Are you guys really just gonna leave Santa in this most critical time of need? Why is this one elf way older than all of the other elves? I'm not striking. Oh, they're going on strike. <laughs> Okay, here's the real Santa. Oh, and it's Diva calling. I like how it's actually called Diva. Was that just a still image of Santa in front of the monitor? Yeah, it is. It makes it easier to edit if he's not moving. And we want better working conditions. <laughs> this is a little bit too real, to be honest. <laughs> like, I think Santa's actually the bad guy. He's going on the naughty list here. We'll just grow the beard out a bit. Not bad. There we go. There's our Santa Claus. Well, he's more of a Grinch, but let's not talk about it for now. Oh, and of course, the Santa Claus-style glasses. But don't worry, he's the same gym underneath. I'm kind of glad we got his weight up a bit because he really pulled it off. I, I still don't know if he's buff or fat anymore. I really don't know. <laughs> now, he getting limbered up. That's probably a good idea. Oh, look. Look at his son who's knocked over the bin again. He didn't raise him right. I don't understand why he picked up these nasty traits from having a father that goes around killing people and locking people in the basement. How's it going down here, by the way? <laughs> Ah, everything looks fine. All right, let's get out there and start stealing Christmas. All right, well, he's in the same room as his bloody presents. <laughs> hey, I'm Santa Claus. Dad. No, not your dad, just Santa Claus. <laughs> How can I get him out of the house? Oh my god, my bills are six grand, almost seven. Ah, consider Christmas ruined. <laughs> he's like, yes, quite. Everything went exactly according to plan. <laughs> Sing Flingle Zibs. Uh... Everyone except for Santa. Oh, this is a great holiday. Yeah. Do you like that Santa? <laughs> he knows we're singing, but he doesn't know the song. Oh, it's such a great holiday. Yay. Oh, look, a cake for someone. <laughs> and look who happens to be hungry. Ignore the bones. It's completely safe. Oh, there he goes. Let's see if he can actually live through this. Good man, well done. All right, now milk him. See what he's made out of you. All right, what do you got? Essence of discomfort. Oh, you can drink that yourself. I'm not drinking that. Or I guess I could give it to random people when they come over. Yeah, that's a good idea. I've already got essence of sadness. Welcome, new prisoner. Trust me, you are loved. <laughs> Jesus, he is the happiest prisoner ever. That's what we need more of, Lewis. You understand? Stop groaning all the time. Is he gonna be able to sleep with that guy singing? If anything, this is just more punishment for Lewis. <laughs> Wake up, Lewis! <laughs> Please! <laughs> this poor fecker! Oh no, oh no, did he see me change? Oh no, now he knows I'm the real Santa. <laughs> I'm even trespassing when I'm outside, apparently. They all hate Christmas. They're all a bunch of Scrooges. Imagine you were this dude, and I'm just staring out from between the banisters as Santa Claus. Some weird festive edition of it. All right, let's throw away that present someone gave me. I know it's feckin' rude, but... Oh my god, it landed on the roof. That doesn't help me at all. All right, how about that? Inspect the fish. <laughs> you just hear like... <laughs> <laughs> Go across the ground, just a slippery, slimy fish. Oh, he cyberpunked his way right through the doors. Perfect. No, you didn't see shit, did you? Holy shit. Well, now you didn't. Oh, God, now there's one left in the garden. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on, I think I'm okay. Just give me my fish back and let me climb that pipe. It's gotta be a unique sentence, surely. Surely no one said that before. I think I got a serious situation with possible dead body. Uh, I think they found out about me and I can't seem to hang here. There we go. Okay, I'm in. Wait. Did my target go downstairs? After all that, I was trying to get up here to kill him and now he's gone downstairs. Oh my God. Oh, now I gotta sneak my way downstairs. There's people fecking everywhere. Okay, run, run. Uh-oh. Snake's gone hiding. 
Echo Alpha! I just dropped the gun. I don't think that's gonna work at this stage. <laughs> like, sorry, sorry, just passing by. Sorry, sorry, my bad, my bad, sorry. Don't worry, I know where I can get a wicked disguise. There we go. I'm a waiter now. Oh god, they're trying to run. Is this one Marv? I think this is Marv. <laughs> just ignore us, chefs. Okay, maybe don't ignore him forever. I need him to be revived again. Here, look. Chefs love fish, don't they? Are you alright? Yes, okay, he's noticed. How are you reviving him? What are you doing? I need help now! I thought he could revive him. I didn't think he'd need help. Oh no. Oh no, they're looking for me. I like how they're just reviving this thief who shouldn't be down here. Now he's wandering into their wine cellar, which probably has very expensive wine. But yet Santa's the problem, huh? Feck, feck, feck. How was that crime noticed? I was around the corner. Is that even a crime? Smashing a brick? Well, there goes my feckin' challenge now because one of them just smashed. Oh no, wait, it got him. It got him. Okay, that was a crime. Hooray! <laughs> Christmas miracle. All right, here's my great plan, okay? There's a lot of, uh parts to this plan. It's like Ocean's Eleven, but with one man. Okay, so I'm outside and I've called him over. And now I'm gonna run inside and steal his presents. <laughs> oh god. He came right in when I robbed it. Oh well, he didn't, uh, he didn't seem to notice, I don't think. I mean, he looked sad to begin with, so it's hard to tell, but he, I think it's okay. What the hell was that about? You try and be mischievous with me? Watch this. Yeah, that's right. Now you've got tinnitus. Where's he gone? Okay, I guess... I guess it's my turn to hide. <laughs> Alright, let's make it up to him. Let's invite him to a fake party. Alright, he likes me again. Okay, on to the next. Oh my god, it's that guy I keep trying to kill, but he keeps getting away. Wait, what the hell is that beauty? It's like a discount version of Grognak. An even bigger discounted version of Grognak. <laughs> He's just walking by my house just to taunt me, I bet. My house is right there. He's angry now all of a sudden. Well, let's Santa cheer you up, buddy. Don't you worry. There's your present. What does Noxious Cloud do? I have to know. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. That's quite the fight. Wait, he likes it. You sick bastard, I'm going home. Oh my god, he's so angry. <laughs> Santa's like, Diva, hold on a second. Let's not include people based on their religion, okay? I don't want to deal with anyone but Christians. Let me discriminate. Just come back to work and everything will be fine. Your demands are ludicrous. <laughs> He's getting so pissed off. This is just such a bizarre idea for a movie. Who sat down and was like, we should... Make a Christmas movie about kids who have to save Christmas, but it's on behalf of a tyrant and the elves all just want equal rights and to include everyone, uh, but they're the bad guys in the story. <laughs> I wonder when we get to the credits, will it just pop up written and directed by Jeff Bezos? Now I'm going to bed while you work yourselves to death. Goodbye. What? <laughs> what the hell is this? How are the rest of them not waking up through this? I'm gonna chill on you! What does that mean? He's gone mad! <laughs> Honestly, this guy is the next Santa. He's exactly like him. You know what Santa needs? He needs a well-trained sniper <laughs> to just take this guy out. Officially, Christmas is cancelled. Probably for the best. I don't know why everyone's shocked. This is a good thing. He's working you to the bone. I just have one more thing to say to all of you. I have a bomb. Oh, yeah, he's he's going on holiday. <laughs> he didn't seem that bothered about Christmas being cancelled at all. I'm surprised he stuck around this long. I don't know why the sad music is playing. A slave labor camp got shut down. Shouldn't we be celebrating? This movie has confused me. Come on, guys. If anyone can save Christmas, it's us. I don't know why you think it's you. You've done nothing but cause trouble. What if we got some of our friends? Yeah, pull them into this situation. That's a good idea. This is so cool. <laughs> what? No, it's not. You've been kidnapped. This guy got got Stockholm Syndrome fast. He wanted to escape like 15 minutes ago. Okay, that is actually killing him. I know I brought him back last time, but I don't think I will this time because this can give me essence of life, which can extend Jim's life, and I want to get rid of his vampirism, so this will help me out a lot. Good job, Lewis, doing the Lord's work. Plus, we have a new prisoner now, and his name is Father Time Christmas Santa Claus. Count him yet. Yeah, exactly. Count him yet, but yeah. He's praising the plant after killing someone. All right, get that milk. Why not? Essence of life. Yes, good job. He's a good pet pl plant thing. Wait, how the hell did he get in here? Ryland Oakley? Who the hell is Ryland Oakley? Is he the new Santa Claus or something? I mean, it would make sense if he came down the chimney. Oh, he is! Okay, maybe I can flirt with him. Yeah? Oh. <laughs> it's working. Is Jim just really suave or is Santa Claus really easy? 
Because this is working great every time. Woohoo, an observatory. Go on. Oh, he likes the sound of the observatory. Oh my god, that's so weird. <laughs> Try with Ryland. I guess he's probably been there since Christmas. Like he came down that chimney instead of the main one by accident. <laughs> that sounds a bit worrying. It sounds more like a murder than woohoo. Ah! Laughing about giving me more coal because you won't be laughing soon. Jim has learned that Ryland is a father winter. Okay, so there is many of them. Oh, oh, oh. What do you just call me? You gave me a loan. I didn't even ask him for a loan. I guess Jim just did it. God damn it, he's leaving. All right, I'll get him later. I almost had him too. My sim won't listen to me. She won't get out even though I canceled the bath. Jim wants to play in there. It's not fair. He's not really playing, is he? He's just having a bat. Well, I guess he's messing around a bit. Bells. The bells are leading me to here. That's him. Yes, Santa Claus is dead, everyone! <laughs> oh, the bells have finally stopped. The sky is uh, as Santa 47. Oh my god, fantastic! Pick up holiday fire axe. <laughs> Ooh, and a present for little old me. Remote CX demo block. Okay. I like how it says I'm trespassing, but that's Santa's specialty after all, isn't it? Merry Christmas. <laughs> the poor dude. Oh my god, my inventory is so full with all these presents. Over there! Will you stop running away? No, don't tell. Oh my god, he is literally running in circles. So he's done a full loop. Got no visual. <laughs> That's because you ran away. Don't run from Santa Claus. It only pisses him off more. And he's already a bit unstable. All those people. Merry feckin' Christmas to you. <laughs> there was no even explosion. Just a poof. It's the magic of Santa Claus. Why are they storing the people I've killed in the attic? <laughs> That's so strange. Wouldn't the basement be more fitting? It's what I do. It's practical. It's hard to haul bodies upstairs. But downstairs, you just kind to let him flop. God, look at all those bodies. <laughs> the whole place is cleared out now. <laughs> they must want to get home for Christmas. I am trapped in this room. There's people at the exits. Oh, there's someone even just staring over there. There's no way for me to get out. I might just have to try and climb out the window. <laughs> Not Santa's usual MO, but <laughs> he'll have to try his best. <laughs> if only there was a bloody chimney around here. I'd scurry up that in no time. <gasps> a present all the way up here. A crowbar. This must be for me. Break winch. Ah, sure, why not? I'm up here anyway. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, guards. That was a bit overkill just for you when you really didn't even have to die. I haven't seen anything suspicious yet. <laughs> you might want to open your eyes. Maybe the guy is just literally blind. Yep, it's as quiet as the grave. Oh, come on, dude. That's a bit insensitive. People are dying here. <laughs> okay, I think I can make it out of here. Oh, no, there's people here. I can't get past them. Circumcision knife? Who gives that as a gift for Christmas? What's that supposed to mean? There we go. Okay, time for the first trial. The first challenge is simple. It's just a fight. Three rounds. And whoever wins two out of three rounds wins the first challenge. They're locked up in this cage. And of course, you may have an advantage or disadvantage depending on your clothing. So they're both going to fight naked. Jim will be the referee. And he just gets to be the guy in the movie. He goes, there's only one rule. No rules. And then they fight. Oh my god, this is intense. All right, let the fight begin. Oh, some good slaps there. I'll be a commentator for this fight. Uh, I see a lot of things I don't want to see. And <laughs> Jim got bored. He went away. He's like, I'm not watching this. He's very happy. He's loving this. Oh, god damn it, he won. I'm kind of hoping for the other guy. I want Ryland to win. Okay, that's one round for Clement. I like how they start chatting afterwards, like, great fight and all, but how about that coffee? <laughs> now they're singing together. Like, they hate each other, they're enemies. It's not a singing contest. Fight again, fight. Stop it, no one's gonna win this. You both have beautiful voices. He's gonna let him finish his solo. He's like, oh, this is good, actually. <laughs> okay, round two. What are their skills like? Fitness for Clement is three, and Ryland is three also. Okay, so it's an even fight. Oh my god, okay, Clement has won won the first round. Just another weird thing that's gonna be in my front garden now. <laughs> I can have free range prisoners in here. All right, you're done. The next battle is a simple one. Three games of chess. Moving from the physical into the mental, you know? Just trying to ignore Dick who's just beating up that bear. He's got problems. I don't know why. He's just been wailing on it for so long now. Of course, depending on who's wearing what, you could have particular advantages in chess. So they're both going to do this naked. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep it fair, you know? Kind of hard to see all the moves when half the board is blurred. Can we get rid of the sensor? But oh, no, let's not do that. Okay, that's good. That's a great angle to look at these two naked men playing chess. I want to see who has the brain and who has the brawn. I don't want Clement to be winning everything. 
This is thrilling. Ah, Ryland won. Very good, very good. Oh, meal. Is that a victory? I don't know. That was just a good move. Okay. Oh, no, that was a victory. Okay, never mind. He's admitted defeat. Two victories for Ryland in that. They're tied. One for one. <laughs> Next one should be a lot of fun. Good old-fashioned dance battle. <laughs> Jim's gonna be the DJ, of course. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> that guy, the way he crossed his arms. Wait a second. That is the guy that tells on us. I don't like him. Well, luckily, now that they've brought an additional four people, it seems like getting presents for the entire world is an achievable goal. We made all those toys for the little boys and girls all over the world. Wait, just like that? In one day? What? What? What is this? That was unprompted, by the way. There was no context. I, I would provide it if there was, but there was nothing. He just kind of stood up and started dancing. Why are they cheering? The slave driver's back. I don't understand why they're happy to see him. We're all really sorry. Yeah, the, the Stockholm Syndrome is after sinking in seriously. It, it's really bad. It's terminal. Oh my god, they're giving him a gift. It is terminal. That is a very uncomfortable photograph. A bow tie. Yes. You know I like spiffy ties. I know. <laughs> They're best friends now all of a sudden. He doesn't even take off the tie. He wants to wear the tie and the bow tie. I'm sending you back. If you tell your parents, you're dead. I don't know how I got stuck with this I group. got a Manny Penny appointment at 4.30, so if we could move this boot camp thing along. I'm a good child, not a prick. <laughs> what is this montage? <laughs> that guy was terrifying. I'm a good child. <laughs> They're like best friends and I don't know why. Oh, it's the real Santa this time. Oh my god, I was so naive earlier when I said it wouldn't be the real Santa in the mall, but it is. Maybe I learned a valuable lesson along the way, too. I'm just not sure what it was. I think it's go capitalism. Go capitalism! Yeah, that's it. Santa Claus is a symbol for the act of giving and sharing with others. Then why wasn't that in the movie? Believe in yourselves. My name is Sarah. I've only just realized I'm only learning some of their names now. Eric's a good name. Eric's a beautiful name. It really is. <laughs> what a way to end the film. I don't even understand why. Why was it him? He wasn't really involved in the movie. The final line of the film. Eric's a beautiful name. Cheers to you, Eric. I know you're watching this and I just want you to have a great Christmas. <laughs> oh god, that's three to one and he's laughing about it. Ryland lost. He lost three to one at basketball. Why are you so useless at everything? Why were you always my favorite if you're so bad at doing stuff? All right, well, we know what that means. On to the very last challenge. This one is just for Clement, though. Eat him. They're like, uh... <laughs> Eat him! <laughs> he's trying to sing his way out of this. Even when he's about to be eaten, he's singing. He's such a great guy. I'll leave you finish your duet. It's really nice. You're both really good at singing. Oh, Jesus Christ. He really didn't hesitate in the end, did he? And then they go back to sing after he stabbed them that many times. Okay, here we go again. I guess the good song was over. Now he's dead, but it's not over. You have to finish both plates. Oh, God, there's more than one serving there. He doesn't seem to mind. I guess he'd be all tender after that fighting. He's just enjoying it, to be honest. Thought this would be kind of a punishment, but he doesn't seem to care. Chat with Ryland. He's not there. He's dead. What are you doing? He's like talking to himself when eating. I think he's in denial. Quality excellent, made by Clement Frost. A meat made from a sim. <laughs> Keep eating, come on, you're gonna have to eat the whole thing before you can get out of there. Oh, he's leaving the eyes to last. I do the same, I think. Wait, add wedding topper. <sighs> Wow. <laughs> what are you doing? I thought the zombie apocalypse was over, for feck's sake. <laughs> this guy's just watching. That is beautiful, though. That is lovely. All right, keep eating. He's feeling a bit queasy, but other than that, he's, he's getting through it. It's just a lot to eat. Oh, wait. Where did that water come from? <laughs> he still needs the bathroom, so I'm not sure where that came from. Oh, he doesn't need the bathroom anymore. This thing is watertight as well, so he could end up drowning. God, he was a big man. <laughs> he keeps eating and eating, but it just keeps coming. Why is my dad naked? Oh, he's showering the rain, of course. <laughs> showering the rain under the balcony. <laughs> and not even the fact that it's human meat, but the sheer amount. I thought he would have to give up by now, but he keeps eating. He just has an, a bottomless stomach. I guess that's why he eats all our cookies, isn't it? Uh, every Christmas. Okay, he ate it all and immediately fell asleep. He had a long day. A gift immediately. What have I got? This better be something good. <laughs> what? Xmas star. This feels like they just rebranded to Xmas stars to cash in. This is just a wrench. <laughs> this is something I would buy my father. What's this one? Oh, <gasps> this is more like it. What could it be? A book? A CD? Wait a second. I think it's just a shovel. I don't need a feckin' shovel. I'm gonna re-gift this. There we go. <laughs> oh my god, that was a hell of a clunk <laughs> when it hit him in the face. Wait, oh, I thought they just didn't realize it was me. I'm gonna mix in with the crowd just like Assassin's Creed. Oh, look, it's working. 
thing, just like in Assassin's Creed. <laughs> oh, damn it. Unfortunately for me, the three people standing next to me were all triplets, so it made me stand out more. <laughs> He's on his radio like, uh, sir, there's a piracy issue outside. <laughs> right, there's got to be another way in here, right? Oh, scaffolding. I've already spotted it, but how do I get up there? <laughs> The hell was that? Oh my god, this is the ghost from Christmas past, I think. What's up? Just a pirate walking in there with this shovel wrapped up. What is that noise? I feel like I'm being haunted. And now there's bells. Is that guiding me towards the presence? I'm just following the bells. I think the bells are gonna drive me mad. <laughs> just like in Game of Thrones. I know I'm not referring to how she went mad at the end. I'm talking about how I went mad watching her go mad from bells. Oh, the present room. They're gifts for staff. I will just become staff. Oh, there's one of them. What's he doing? Oh, just that. <laughs> okay. He's acting like a sim, just going up to the mirror and going, ah, Zuma Domborb. Wait, why are you messing with the tap? We're the wet bandits. Wait, how can you go that way? You're not staff. I had to go to a lot of effort to get this disguise and get through here, and you just walk through even though you're clearly a burglar? This is mine. You can't steal this. It's mine. I don't even want it. I'm just like, I don't want you to have it. Uh, the spirit of Christmas. And now he's stealing someone's wine. You're a good thief. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> the heist of the century <laughs> takes a sip out of their glass. Oh, <gasps> present. A proximity explosive duck. Okay, this really seems like it was specifically for me. I don't think I even stole that one. Hey, Mr. Waiter. Hey, Mr. Waiter. Are you like seven? Let's <laughs> <laughs> be the graveyard restaurant mix. It's just new and exciting. You know, the family is kind of running low. I should probably get Santa abducted so he can have a baby. There we go. All right, see in a bit, Santa. To get pregnant now. Jim is a family man through and through, and he needs his babies. Come on. Pregnant? I don't know. We'll do it again just to be sure. Right, off he goes again. All part of the cult. Winterfest really wasn't up to Ryland's expectations. Well, yeah, he spent the whole day getting abducted by aliens. But the greatest gift you can give someone is life. Get back up in that spaceship. Oh, he's all tired out. Let's go once more. All right, it's time to go home. I had a good spa day. I feel very relaxed. Walking home in a blizzard in your robe. Jesus Christ. When he wants something, he just feckin' does it, doesn't he? Come on, folks, you're going home. Everyone's going home. At least Santa is dressed for it. Oh my god, they almost got hit by a car. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, Santa was almost there and he fell asleep. <laughs> Wait, why is he going the other way? No, go home. Dude, you were like a foot away from there and you fell asleep and then turned back. Oh, now they want to get inside. <laughs> they must be freezing. Yep. I think he's pregnant. Look at how sad Santa is. Mourning from losing a friend. Remembering a sim that passed away and forgotten birthday. <laughs> Read obituaries. Grim might get a bit of fun out of that. Go for it. It's almost Grimey's time. Make the most of these final days. Well, you're about to have a sibling, I think. I don't know if I've got the baby stuck or what, but it's not coming out. Oh, we gotta go to the hospital. Let's go. He still wants to clean. What, are you freaking out now? Yeah, I know. You're having a baby. There's a nice ghost at the counter. Don't worry. Uh, check in, I suppose. Hey, Doc. Yeah, I know. Last time I brought you a pregnant Grim Reaper. Now I got a pregnant Santa Claus for you. Put down the mustard or the wood glue or whatever the hell that is. Man, the miracle of childbirth. <laughs> I don't think this guy even works here. Ryland just gave birth to a baby boy. This baby needs a name. The uh, first name Oakley? No, that won't work. How about first name Pickens? Wait. Oh, God. He's had twins. Second one, Pickens. Then we'll all remember who the first one was. I was almost expecting a third one to come up. <laughs> Wait, where's the other one? Wait, where'd the first one go? I thought they were gonna bring him back to the feckin' store for a second. Like, damn it, somebody's gotta put bread on the table. Oh, Jesus, I don't want them at all. I guess we can just leave Santa take care of them in the basement. But we really don't have the space for twins down here, do we? Good luck, Santa Claus. God, it's just crying in stereo. <laughs> He's feeling very flirty for some reason. He wants to go back to the toilet in the store. Santa baby. Oh, and look where Jim is. Skinny dip with Grim. I want to see that. I think everyone does. Huh, he's still smoking. Wait, why is this censored? What's going on? This is- that was really uncomfortable. What was that about? <laughs> Breastfeed the other one too, may as well. I think the Santas will take good care of them. Uh, that's what I'm gonna choose to believe anyway. Come on, Jim, let's go to the store or something. Wait, why are you still naked going around the house? Grimey's coming in, gets a very unfortunate view up the stairs. Why are they not showing up? I don't understand. Only one is showing up at a time. Use one of your new things. Look, sure sale. Use that on him. Okay, what did he decide to buy, though? Because if he bought this, I don't think it'll cost that much. 905? What the hell? It's a masterpiece, apparently. That is a masterpiece. I cut him apple head. <laughs> it's like, by God, you're a genius. Oh, my God.
god. Oh, they found the mother lord. Someone help me! What? What do you mean? I don't... Okay, I guess I scared them off. Oh, you got all the good stuff. You got like a toy tank and a shurikens, a battle axe. Oh my god, they got everything. A cowboy hat. No wonder you're robbing these people. God, they're good at treasure hunting. I was struggling to find everything, but this was much easier. They got everything for me. Now I can go hunt down Santa Claus and find some bricks before I come back down to them. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm getting changed. I'm a pirate who just happens to work here as a waiter, okay? <laughs> it's not suspicious. I don't understand. They're all suspicious of me now. Now, is it because of my sword on my back? Can I drop it? This is a bad idea, isn't it? But just drop the saber. Okay, there we go. Yeah, they, they don't mind now. The saber just had to go. <laughs> just leave that on the floor. A little bit of a hazard, but that's okay. Oh, God, I'm trespassing. I have no idea where I am. Sorry, sorry. I. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, I'm making this worse. I'm trespassing and I don't know how to get out of here. And they're going to start opening fire any second. Can I jump out the window? I'd like to jump out the window. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> you ever in a social situation, you just want to jump out the window. This is basically what that was. Oh, no. Oh, no. They're going to come outside. They're going to come outside and they're going to shoot at me. Uh-oh. They just tried to nade me. <laughs> okay, they flashbanged me, but I'm still going. That's fine. I'm getting out of here. I'm going into the attic and I'm not coming down until all the guests are gone. Oh, it's really bringing me back to my childhood. Wait, how do they know I'm up here? What the hell? Oh, sweet Jesus. Over there! I don't know how to melee attack, so there you go. Can I just change my clothes real quick? Oh, God damn it. He saw me. What the hell? He went the other way. I'm just running to secure Santa Claus. Oh, God, they all know that I'm not a bodyguard. Okay. I'm running this way now to get Santa Claus. <laughs> Santa Claus! You see, he is real! Okay, I think the heat has died down. They've just forgotten about the murders. <laughs> okay, I gotta find Santa and, and try and kill him before he disappears. I do believe there's time to do it. Investigate. Yeah, sure. I need pictures. Pictures of Santa Claus. Where are you, Santa Claus? There he is. He's jingling again. The bastard. I bet he's back in there, isn't he? Fecker. <laughs> Where's he gone? Don't ask me to leave your house ever again. All I wanted to do was bake a cake. Goodbye, Falcon. Whatever the hell your name is. Oh, a ghost is coming in for some cake. Come on, join me. I'm friends with the dead. Oh, he's back. Uh, excuse me one second, miss. There we go. Oh, and she's haunting your counter. We're quite the double team. I hope all your cutlery gets mixed together. Now I'll go home. Not because you want me to, because I want to. I feel like I've murdered people in this house before. Yeah, I definitely murdered the entire family that used to live here. I'm here to sleep because I've just been stealing Christmas. Oh, grimy. Grimey aged up. I'm gonna make him absolutely mental. Oh, she's getting on in the years now. She's just looking better than ever, though. I don't know if I spoke too soon. He's dangerously close to standing in that puddle while he eats that cereal in that electrified water. Eh, it's fine. Kids can't die. All right, we're in a good mood. Off we go. We got a few more houses to hit. Did I rob these people already? I know I robbed Falcon because I got him abducted. I think this one's next. What, what the hell was that? Where where did this come from? What what was this? Uh, oh well. Where, where's he going? I told him to knock on the door. Was oh, he going around back? He must be. Uh, while well, we're here. Merry fucking Christmas. Um, here comes Santa Claus. Here comes Santa Claus. Right down Santa Claus Lane. I'm stealing your stuff. Oh god, there's the kid. I think I got caught. <laughs> I can't steal anything for another eight hours? Are you serious? That's it, I'm going to bed. All right, I'm sleeping away and they don't seem to notice. I wonder whose bed I'm actually in. At least I'm not in the kid's bed, I suppose. 30 minutes left. They must be wondering. They must be like, oh, he must be gone. No. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, why did she have to come up at that exact moment? Oh, I got kicked out. God damn it. You try and steal Christmas and they get mad at you for no reason. The biggest house in the neighborhood. They must have the biggest presents. Whoa, what is this little thing? Can I steal it? Oh god, what the fuck? Oh, okay, it's alright. Oh, Jesus, that was scary. <laughs> oh, what an adorable kid. Oh, look at her. And just then, Jim Pickens' heart grew three times. It's no, I'm just messing with you. All right, see you, kid. I'm gonna go steal your Christmas. And your parents must not love you very much if they leave you out here by the side of the road. All right, see you later. Oh, the mother load. And the mother. You need to go take care of your kid. Oh, it's all clear. I don't know where she went, but it's all clear. Where did she go? Oh, you know what? I don't care. Just get the presents and run. I still need to wait four hours. I forgot. Wait, no. It's almost Jim's birthday. No. Oh, God. Do I have enough for a potion of youth? I've not been keeping on top of his age. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, I've got loads to get a potion of youth. That's no problem. All right, I'll take one when I get home. Yes. Yes. 
Very good. <laughs> it just runs by at the speed of light. Meow. <laughs> what? Oh no, oh no, oh no, they want to open fire on Santa Claus as he's making his escape. Oh my god, everyone in this room knows that Santa isn't real. <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh, I am so screwed. You're trespassing. I know I'm trespassing, I'm going to steal your helicopter and deliver toys to the children. Yes, steal it. Yes, Christmas is saved. <laughs> he's just like, oh man, how did we let that happen? We thought it was like some sideshow thing for the kids. Santa Claus waving from the helicopter. <laughs> and then he just takes off. Oh, there we have it. Christmas is ruined. And remember to subscribe to my channel. Or else. More, 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 like, right, 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 more, 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 Right, 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 right